It is our coming to Wakebrook Behavioral Health Facility. UNC Health is ending services it provides to the facility, which the county owns. These changes are effective September 30th of this year. WREL's Shelly Jackson joins us live from Wakebrook. And Shelly, are people going to lose their jobs with all this? Chris, yes, UNC Health says it will lay off 246 workers. Now, for the past decade, UNC Health has contracted and worked out of this county-owned facility here, but now the county is going to have to find another provider to replace UNC Health. And meanwhile, this announcement is going to leave some folks without health care. The announcement could leave many patients without mental health help or substance abuse treatment. It's just devastating, really. Wake Mental health advocate Ann Ackland has been fighting to keep Wakebrook open. And a lot of people that go there are homeless. You know, they, they have no place to stay. Then they have no insurance. They A lot of them don't have family support. Many are addicts, and they find um, a place there to go and detox. Denise Foreman, assistant county manager for Wake County, says both UNC and Wake County had funded Wakebrook, but UNC was shifting focus and would not be able to fund the Wakebrook services going forward, leaving a big funding gap. It's a pretty substantial gap and it was going to increase on an annual basis moving forward. Some of those services include a facility-based crisis service, crisis and assessment services, an alcohol and drug detoxification unit, and inpatient psychiatric unit for adults. The county is currently negotiating with a provider who will cover three of those services. That should be announced next week. But Wakebrook will close for a while. So we do anticipate there will be gaps uh, between when UNC leaves and the new provider starts. But we're going to do everything we can to mitigate that and to keep that as short as possible. UNC Health tells WRAL it is working diligently to find new positions for these valued employees within the UNC Health system. Some Wakebrook employees will transfer to positions at UNC Health Rex in Raleigh and UNC Medical Center in Chapel Hill. And now the county tells me they hope that that gap in coverage will be short. But in the meantime, folks can dial 988 if they need any assistance. Chris? A very valuable resource. Shelly Jackson reporting live. Thank you, Shelly.